Mass production of drum bins in a factory typically. Mass production of drum bins in a factory typically involves several key processes that are highly automated to ensure efficiency, consistency, and cost effectiveness. Here's a general outline of the production process, steel or plastic sheets. For metal drums, steel sheets, usually galvanized or stainless, are prepared, while plastic drums are typically made from high-density polyethylene, HDPE. Cutting, large rolls or sheets, owe several key processes that are highly automated to ensure efficiency, consistency, and cost effectiveness. Here's a general outline of the production process, steel or plastic sheets. For metal drums, steel sheets, usually galvanized or stainless, are prepared, while plastic drums are typically made from high-density polyethylene, HDPE. Cutting. Large rolls or sheets of material are fed into machines that cut them into the required sizes for forming the drum's body, lid, and base. Rolling the drum body. Steel sheets are rolled into cylindrical shapes and welded together along the seam for metal drums. For plastic drums, molds are used for forming. Bottom and lid formation. The base and lid are either stamped out of steel or molded from plastic. The steel bases are then welded onto the cylindrical body. Blow molding for plastic drums. In the case of plastic drums, blow molding is used to shape the drum by inflating melted plastic inside a mold to form the body. Welding, metal drums. The bottom and sometimes the top lid are welded onto the cylindrical body using automated welding machines, ensuring airtight sealing. Lid attachment, plastic drums. For plastic drums, a lid may be heat sealed or mechanically attached, depending on the design, painting, coating, metal drums. After welding, metal drums are coated with protective layers such as paint or powder coatings. This prevents corrosion and improves durability. Surface finishing, plastic drums. Plastic drums may undergo surface finishing processes like trimming to ensure a smooth, consistent product. Leak testing. Both plastic and metal drums are tested for leaks by either pressure testing or using vacuum techniques to ensure they are airtight and watertight. Dimensional checks. Automated systems measure the drums to ensure they meet design specifications. Lid and seal installation. In some cases, removable lids are assembled along with sealing rings or gaskets. Drums designed for hazardous materials often have special locking mechanisms, stacking and palletizing. Completed drums are stacked and placed onto pallets, ready for transport. Labeling. Drums are labeled with essential information such as capacity, type of material, safety warnings, and handling instructions. Automation and robotics in mass production. In modern factories, robotic arms and automated systems are extensively used for welding, cutting, molding, and even material handling to ensure precision, reduce labor costs, and increase production speed.